Hey guys, Cypher Reduction 16 here, and um, so today um, I saw that you guys really liked my uh, animatronic videos. Um, I don't know, I just, they just they've been blowing up a little bit, a lot more than my other videos. So I'm like, all right, I guess I'll post more content because I love making them. So um, anyway, yeah. So um, like, as you can see, I know somebody. Com I mean, I think it was I mean Snow Business commented, and he wanted me to make this into Billy Bob or. Many people kept, oh no, it wasn't, well, he didn't want me to, he asked if it was going to be Billy Bob. I know a lot of people have commented and asked, like, Billy Bob, Billy Bob, no, it's not Billy Bob, it's my own character, and these are my own characters too, this is my own show, I don't really want to copy any, any of those shows, because there's so many people that copy them, and I kind of want to make it my own. So, um, yeah, so, you guys might see that there's, there's no wires going to these wires are all messed up there's no wires going to these movements at all because i had to cut them because i had to put the shirt on him and his guitar is being is posed it can be posed right now so i'm just seeing which way i like it if i like it like this or if i i like it like this or who knows i'm just kind of messing i kind of like it like that but yeah so i don't i can't i don't have anything running right now and obviously i can't run anything because there's nothing these, these two movements wouldn't work and I'm adding another movement here that I found I had a mechanism for. This is the mechanism out of a talking toucan. And it is this thing bought if you spin it, it this can't do it one hand, but kind of it bobs up and down, but I can I can mount this in the back and I can build a mechanism so I can have like a little guitar slide type of mechanism. So that should be pretty cool. But anyway, so here's a blue shirt. These are his pants. I just got him a Goodwill. He spent like 20, 10, it was like 10 bucks on all of them. And then I have wood and then I have carpeting for the stage. So then I have fur. He's going to have that type of fur. So he's definitely not going to be a Billy Bob. So um, yeah, stay tuned. And I guess I will post an update. Oh, uh, well, I guess, I, I, so yeah, I guess this will be either part one or part two or no idea. But um, I'm sure there's another video coming soon on these guys. So, um, yeah, so, um, I'll post, I'll let you guys know when I get more stuff done with this character. So, hey guys, yeah, I'm back. Um, so, as you can see, a lot of progress is done. So, his shirt is now, per well, I think it was on pretty good last, in the last clip, I don't remember. But, um, I, it looks a lot better on camera, but I got his arm all furred up. I just got to adjust it so it's like that and not as tilty as it is right now. But once it's like that, he'll look pretty cool. It kind of looks like, um midgen beach bear i don't know how but big midgen beach bear but um anyway so yeah he has his hand mechanism and it looks kind of bad right now it's not stuffed there's barely any stuffing in it and the fur is just kind of hot glued on there. there's no like final cover on it so it's just it was just to test it and i have I've, i tested this movement and then it broke so i just tested that for like three seconds it broke and i put it back on i'm like might as well record it because uh, i would love this information and then I tested this movement. I don't have to do anything to it. But it goes out like that. And then his guitar hand. I can't move his guitar hand manually, but I can move this manually. So, um, yeah. So, um, as you saw in the last, the bird, the clip with the birds, his foot tap broke. But it's still not adjusted perfectly. So, um, you might, so when this comes out, you might not. It's not, it's, um, it's still not perfectly, so. It probably will break when in this next clip, but I'm gonna test all the movements right now. So here we go. Oh, dumb. It might help if I plug the power supplies in. Um, I was hoping that this will all be. I don't remember which power supply goes where. All right, there we go. Now I need. The five volt power supply. Oh, and um, this bird's um, there's this wire off right here, and it goes to that bird. This one's moving so side to side, so he won't not be working in this clip. But there we go. Look how good that looks. But see, that bird's supposed to be dancing, but he's not dancing. What type's not breaking? That looks pretty good. It doesn't look bad at all. I like the extra wiggle that it has. I 
It's gonna break itself in a minute. But like this is random movement code going through. You guys haven't seen this code yet. Well, you hit it in the birds, but I only have two codes written so far. And I obviously still need to fix that birds. Oh, and you can see he's kind of ripped apart. I was doing some work on him a minute ago. So you can kind of see the mechanism inside, but I really like that strumming. I really like that strumming. That's really some good strumming, so. So yeah, um, yeah, I'll um, obviously get that bird wear again, and I'll do some more progress, but I think this is good for today's video. So this will be part one of my animatronic project, so I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching, and I will, oh, oh no, never mind, before I do that, uh, here's his pants, and I cut them so that he, he look like they're all broken, and they kind of gonna be like, they look like shorts, like right now they're big, but they look like shorts, but um they're gonna go all the way down to his legs so um and, and, I, and i can put feet and stuff so he should look pretty good but i like how the hands are now it seems kind of extra long but i can adjust that a little bit but yeah i think overall this is pretty cool and i've got the obviously you can see i got the wire soldered back in so anyway yeah um thanks for watching and i will see you guys next time